Hello everyone. Uh, this is the time we have actually been waiting for. Just like you know, some days ago I announced and I told you on my Telegram community that RTF testnet is going to begin, uh, which is uh, two days back, which which was meant to be one day a day back. That was yesterday. Now they have actually started. It has started today. Today. Now I want you to I want you all to participate in this testnet so that you can actually accumulate more points. The first thing to get started now is just to go and update your app. Go and update your app on Play Store. Go and update your app. Once you have updated your app on Play Store, then you open the app and you come down here. You click on the RTF hub. Once you get there, you are gonna see the testnet being displayed you can see the challenge here you can see 10 transactions in rtf testnet in web3 wallet that will give you what 100 xp make sure you do this uh, for today perhaps it's something you have to be doing daily you just need to claim this how do you do this just click on check execution execution click on check execution check execution i ah, know you can see insufficient amount of transaction you have made is zero transaction that means i need to make 10 transactions for me to be able to claim this xp point then click on this the old box entirely click on the old box entirely it will take you to your web3 you can see it has loaded web it has loaded it you can see here you will see web2 and you will see web3 once you open it it will be in web2 it will be in web 2 and on the web 2 if you scroll down here you are not going to see anything you're not going to see anything but you need to click and switch to web 3 you need web 3 to do that click switch to web 3 make sure you have strong network then scroll down when you scroll down you are going to see rtf testnet click on it click on rtf testnet once you click on rtf testnet then what is the next thing you will see zero rtf network rtf testnet deposit send and get test tokens you cannot actually perform any transaction you cannot send or receive if you don't have token you are sending that means the first thing you need to do is just to get test token the test the token you'll be using to perform this testnet because they want you to add to you can see the coin be credited to your balance shortly that is all the info the pop-up information uh it means that you need token to be sending and receiving, to be depositing and sending in order for you to perform the testnet. And that's why we need to get the testnet token. Now, they said I've clicked on it and it was successful. They said it will be credited to me shortly. Then I wait for it to be credited. Let me just go back and click on it again to refresh. You can see it's 0 0.1 RTF testnet deposited i'm still waiting for perhaps network for it to properly reflect let me go back and click on it again and now it has finally reflected on my balance is 0.1 rtf textnet make sure that you do not just exhaust it anyhow you are meant to perform 10, 10 transactions according to the instructions here if i go back to rtf group you see the instru instruction here 10 transaction in RTF testnet in web3 wallet you must know how to make use of it maximize it not just wasting it then if you are doing it then you should know the amount you are meant to be sending then now the first thing now is that you must have got the test the wallet you want to be using to perform testnet mix get somebody get somebody who also get somebody's wallet you can use my wallet you can use my wallet here. I will post my wallet on the description below this video where you can send the token to. to. Make sure you need 10 transactions to claim that point. Then just click on send. If you are deposit, if you, are, if you want someone to send to you, just click on deposit to copy your own address. But if you want to send to someone, click on send. Then you paste the address of the person. You put the amount. The amount you can put 0 0.001 let's say i'm putting 0 0.001 sorry network 0 0.001 then transaction fee just click on send 
Something went wrong. Perhaps it might be network. All right. I've actually found a solution to this. And then I think the best solution, you can see to avoid that error, it's mainly network issue. Perhaps if your network is not strong and it's showing that error pop up, that red error pop up, switch your network if it's still the same thing. What you will do is that go and download VPN. Now, you can see this is my VPN I've turned on. This is my VPN. You can just download VPN and pick Singapore. You get download VPN on the Play Store and turn it on. This is the VPN I use. I use Turbo. I'm using Turbo VPN. You can still download it as well. And I've switched to Singapore. Singapore. Just download it on Play Store and then turn it on. Once you turn it on and then you access it. All right. Like I said, in case it is showing that error, I told you to use VPN. Just go and download VPN on Play Store. I use Turbo VPN. And on my Turbo VPN, I, I turn it on. Just not to be seen one kind of error message. Switch that VPN, turn it on. You can see I use VPN. Then when you come there, I told you to come back here and click on send. Once you click on send, copy the wallet address that I paste below of my wallet address. Paste it. Copy the same wallet address of the same person, someone who is doing that same test net. Then you do what? You just put the amount. Please don't waste your testnet token. You can just 301. You get since you have a 0 0.1, then you click on send. Once you click on send, you can see confirm it. You can decide to check it on Explorer. Click Explorer. It will take you use your Chrome. It will open so that you can verify the successful transaction on the chain. This success confirmed. Then you can just come back. You can see it very fast. Come back and do the same thing. Is there three zero and one, so that you will not be wasting your gas fee, your test net token unnecessarily. You are meant to do like ten. Ten transaction. I've done like how many? I've done close to. Close to ten now. Because I've already first used it to test to test run it before checking if it is the best way to go. Confirm it. Let me send the last one now. Confirm. Just send that like ten transactions now. Now go back. When you go back and click here, you will see that. Your phone has reduced. These are the transactions I sent. And then I can let me go back. Go to RTF Hub. When you go to RTF Hub, click on check execution. Click on check execution. You can see here you can see that it has completed i've performed 10 transactions now i can now take my xp take sp you can see it's successful you can see the message it pop up that it is successful then i've actually done that now if i do 100 transaction i will get this 200 xp let me even click on view her. yes if i click if i do 100 transaction that means I will get this. That's why you must you must be careful now you just squander your testnet token. You can be using 0 0.00000 or 54 or 5 strike 4 or 50 before you put one. So that it will enable you to do as many transactions. You can do because you will be requesting for a testnet token every day. Once you exhaust the one given to you per day, you cannot, you have to wait for the following day. Guys, just make sure you are doing this test net. In case you perform this 100 transaction and they give you perhaps 1,000 transaction, just do it as well. Just do it either. Just keep on doing it that way to perform your, your test net. And before you know it, you are getting more XP points. And not only that, make sure you are doing your daily tax 
of uh, subscribing, liking, so, and all those things. When you do that, your point will be will keep increasing and you'll be ranking on the leaderboard. Don't forget, by the end of this month, another, the last snapshot will be taken. That's why take it seriously now and start working on this. Take it seriously now and start working on it, guys. Alright, guys, this is where I'm going to stop this video. This video is just meant for how to perform, how to carry out the testnet. I told you that if your network is bad, just go and use VPN. It will work perfectly for you. But don't forget to first uh, update your app from Play Store before you start this testnet process. And all the information you need will be dropped below on the description below this video and also on my Telegram channel. Do, do well to join my Telegram channel, my Telegram community. Join for more information on to how to go about this. Even if you are a new user, even if you are a new user, you want to you want to participate. You can still participate so that you can be. You can also rank for the third snapshot. Register, do all your tags, and then do all your very do your verification and start this testnet with us. All right, guys. Bye for now.